I will extol thee, my God, O King, and I will bless thy name forever and ever. Every day will I bless thee, and I will praise thy name forever and ever. Great is the Lord, and greatly to be praised, and his greatness is unsearchable. One generation shall praise thy works to another, and shall declare thy mighty acts. I will speak of the glorious honor of thy majesty, and of thy wondrous works, and men shall speak of the might of thy terrible acts, and I will declare thy greatness. They shall abundantly utter the memory of thy great goodness, and shall sing of thy righteousness. The Lord is gracious and full of compassion, slow to anger, and of great mercy. The Lord is good to all, and his tender mercies are over all his works. All thy works shall praise thee, O Lord, and thy saints shall bless thee. They shall speak of the glory of thy kingdom, and talk of thy power. To make known to the sons of men his mighty acts, and his glorious majesty of his kingdom. Thy kingdom is an everlasting kingdom, and thy dominion endureth throughout all generations. The Lord upholdeth all that fall, and raiseth up all those that be bowed down. The eyes of all wait upon thee, and thou givest them their meat in due season. Thou openest thine hand, and satisfieth the desire of every living thing. The Lord is righteous in all his ways, and holy in all his works. The Lord is nigh unto all them that call upon him, to all that call upon him in truth. He will fulfill the desire of them that fear him. He also will hear their cry, and will save them. The Lord preserveth all them that love him, but all the wicked will he destroy. My mouth shall speak the praise of the Lord, and let all flesh bless his holy name for ever and ever. Hallelujah. This is uh, the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. And, and this is our break today. Psalm 145. And we just did all 21 verses. As I greet you in the mighty name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, wherever you are on our own world, planet Earth at this time. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Grace, mercy, peace, and love from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ may be upon you today. Oh, be still, be still, and know God in the stillness. There is God. Hallelujah. So what are we doing today? We want to get our praise on. We want to get our praise on. On with your praise. Get your praise on. Hallelujah. It's good to praise God in another place. The psalmist says, Oh, that men would praise the Lord for his goodness and for his wonderful works towards the children of men. And so we want to, we want to, this is base camp. This is, the, uh, this is where we're going to operate from for the next couple of days. Hallelujah. Out of Psalm 145. There are seven things in there about God that we are called upon to praise him for so I want to share them it's a joy it's a joy but just before we get into that I just want to say when we when we give God praise a number of things begins to happen and it's wonderful to know and I just want to share when you praise God it's soul exercise you're exercising your soul <laughs> just as we exercise our bodies when you praise God your soul is being exercised your spirit is exhilarated in other words there's an excitement that comes into your spirit is enlivened your mind expands believe me and, and strongholds and weights are extracted from your life. Your worship, your execute worship, you experience goodness. Uh, worry, you, 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 find, you learn how to exploit worry. <laughs> Glory be to God. Fear, you learn how to expel fear from your surrounding. And doubt, you just expend out. In other words, you extract everything out of it. And love, love just explode. Hallelujah, your love for God just explode when you worship, when you worship in this fashion. Oh, suffice it to say, worship is not just in singing and clapping your hands and all, and that's an expression of worship indeed, but true worship, ultimate worship, is a life of faith and obedience. And what we want to obey is that we need to praise God, we need to praise Him, and we are going to get our praise on over the next couple of days hallelujah 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 so go over the psalm and i'll come back to you and we'll look at the first thing that we are called upon to praise god for think on these things and let us pray father hallelujah bless your name thank you for this visit lord thank you for another visit thank you lord for the revelation that you brought 
I ask for impartation, O oh Lord. Excite our spirit, Lord. Uh, cause us to exercise our soul over the next couple of days, Lord, and that our love for you will explode, Lord, and we'll experience your goodness, Lord. We will exploit worry and expel fear, Lord, and expend all of our doubt. Oh, Lord, we, we just want to take everything that's going against us and turn it to go for your honor and for your glory. Help us all to do, Lord, from this day forward. We give you all the honor, glory, and praise, even as we declare it done in Jesus' mighty name. Amen.